It's 11 a.m. and Mumpini, age 13, who should have been in school, is at home. Mumpini resides in Lalgu, a small farming community in Savulgu. The community dam from which she draws water from has dried up, making her spend more than five hours a day searching for water. Mumpini hasn't also been able to pay her fees, making her vulnerable to Dawuni, an older man offering to pay her fees on condition that she becomes his young bride. But this story isn't just about Mumpini. It is more about Madisa, Wumpini's mother, whose soul dependent on her farming activities left her stranded due to a poor harvest and low income gain. Her inability to pay her daughter's fees puts Wumpini at the risk of becoming a simple story drives home how climate change affects women and girls. It also becomes clear how climate change increases the probability of unfavorable weather conditions that can affect the livelihoods of households. According to Lepa and Thornton, climate change not only decreases today's incomes, but also makes tomorrow's incomes less predictable, thereby affecting the decision-making power of students. So, how can we secure the community future? I believe it will be to introduce rural women like families and other non-farming enterprises. Through this process, women can be encouraged to come up with diverse sources Income diversification as a climate change strategy is known to play a key role in climate change adaptation strategies and empowers women to make decisions for the betterment of their family. Now that I've told you about how income diversification can help you adapt to climate change, let me tell you what I should our strategy. We will be engaging with our women in a six month training program for beekeeping and animal rearing. Who we will be working with on this project? Firstly, the Ghana government on its rearing for food and jobs project. Secondly, a recognized beekeeping training organization. Thirdly, sister NGOs, donor partners, community leaders, and the media. After the training, they will be given the support to maintain their new and team enterprise. This action, we believe, will not just save Rumpini and many other young girls, but ensure we work towards a greener tomorrow.